Tim Bond. Today we're back with the Mod Spotlight, the Gentleman of Science Mod. Yes, the Gentleman of Science. Hmm, yes. Let's show you what we got. First off, Cane of Justice. Gentleman's trousers, sh gentleman's shoes, jacket, and pack. Clock and a lantern. So first off, I'd like to show you my gentleman's clothing there you go with my monocle look like a gentleman and I have a cane as well and this cane special it's of justice and I'll show you why uh, there is no recipe for the man's clothing yet but let's see if we can show you the recipes oh yeah there is never mind he just hasn't put it on the form yet. He has not shown us on the form, so... See here for the first time? This is how you you just add an ink sack to leather armor to get this. And here's how you make the cane. Wood and two pieces of wood, a stick, iron, leather. Lantern, it's glitched out. I'll show you in a minute and I'll explain. And the clock. Alright, so let's just lay down the clock real quick. <laughs> this little thing moves. It makes a little ticking noise. Looks pretty nice. If you always wanted a clock in Minecraft, here you go. I think it's pretty cool. But for the sake of commentary, let's break it. And then we have these lanterns. They give off light. <coughs> Excuse me. They give off light and they... Uh, just hang on walls and they have a moving animation and they look really cool uh, I don't know why it's not working for me it must be conflicting with uh, another mod I've installed um, so link in the description check out the pic you'll get the gist of it it's pretty cool and those produce light which is really nice and now let's show off <coughs> show off the cane so let's go out here real quick you hold right click and see I'm twirling the cane and the longer you hold it the farther you'll jump oh I did not expect this I did not expect to go that high <laughs> where did I oh, be right back alright and we're back so this time let's just do it a little bit wind the cane up once and woo really cool and has infinite amounts of uses. Let's go really far this time, but straight. <laughs> cool. I uh, put on my armor for good measure. It actually has no wear on it, so once you make it, you have it forever, unless you burn it or something to that accord. So let's go back to the house. Woo! <laughs> really cool. Fun to mess around with. And you can shoot yourself up. Did not expect that. I actually did not test that. That is pretty cool. Alright, so let's go to our next thing. The science part. Liquid nitrogen and antifreeze capsule. Alright. Come here, piggy. One piggy. Alright, two piggies. Who cares? Just one of you guys volunteer to come out here. Here, get, get, get out of here, pig. Alright, come on. There you go. We got ourselves a volunteer here. Hey. So this is like a grenade kind of projectile thingy, and you throw it, and then all of a sudden liquid nitrogen comes out. And it like stays on the ground and like flows like liquid nitrogen, it's so sweet, and it freezes anything that gets near it. Um, you see how I'm frozen, and the only way to counteract this is to drink some antifreeze. Which uh, allows me to walk around in it, and... I have slowness. I guess that allows me to counteract the ability. Oh, I'm frozen again. Alright. So this pig is frozen forever until you leave the game. So he will be like that. Or if you do our next thing. So let me show you how to make this. And I'll explain that in a second what I really what I was trying to say. So this is how you make antifreeze, blaze powder, bucket of water, bowl. I think you should lower it to one blaze powder because it's kind of expensive. 
And here's how you make liquid nitrogen. Oh, you get 32 of them. My bad. No, that's perfectly fine for 32. Okay. Disregard what I said. Liquid nitrogen capsule gets 60. Ice block, glass, and iron. Not bad. So, really cool. Has a cool effect. I'm pretty sure it freezes water. Let's go test it out real quick. Woo! I th that well, I thought it did. <laughs> Maybe if it's underneath, it doesn't work. Here, let's try it right here. Ah, oh, dang it! Come on. No. There. Let's see if it works. It might not work. No, it doesn't look like it. It looks like it only freezes mobs and NPCs. Okay. Still really cool though. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome looking. Alright, so let's go to the next part. Alright, let's dump. Well, never mind. I want to keep that stuff. So let's go to Mystery Pod, Mystery Block, Dormant Mystery Glass Block, and some redstone torches. Yeah, you guys get out of here. Alright, so this is a poisonous gas. It will. It will also take you out of the freezing part of the mob. See how this mob's frozen? Like I said earlier, if you poison him, he'll unfreeze. But let me tell you what this poison does. This poison induces hunger, induces poisoning, blindness, nausea, slowness, and minor fatigue. So let's throw it over there and watch some poisonous gas. And we're going to get hit by it. And there's no known cure for this. So, everything's going dark, I'm getting damaged, L hunger, poison, weakness, mining, mining fatigue, nausea, blindness, uh, <laughs> it's pretty cool, and the piggy died, we'll eat, yeah, comrades, take his meat, alright, this is killing me, get up, alright, <laughs> so, this has two blocks, this block, which will just pour it out constantly you can stop it with a red torch well no wait that one's just active constantly my bad this is the one you stop with a red torch this one is called a the dormant mystery block if you put a torch on it it will stop it wow that's that's hurting me it's like spewing in the air alright get out of here so the red torch keeps it from spewing out, and then that makes it come out. I think it comes out the bottom, though. Let me check. Yep, there it is. <laughs> it's coming out the bottom of it. My bad, guys. <laughs> I don't want to jump in that. I'm kind of glad it did. I didn't want it all over the floor. So let's uh, stop that. Yeah, let's put one of these here. I take an active block in there, piggies. Have fun. I said take an active block. No, no, you can't escape. I know you want to here. Let me jump in there. There. There we go. We just had to get started first. Die, little piggies. <laughs> oh, poor pigs. Well, let's just close this back up. Oh, I ran out of blocks. Oh, I have to jump in there to get it. Uh, I, it's not worth it. <laughs> it's like a poisonous fog constantly releasing unless you put a torch on it. So that's it guys, that's the whole mod so far. I think it's pretty awesome, has some cool random things in it, you get to be a gentleman and you get this sweet cane, Woo. so let's see if we can get on top with the cane, <laughs> awesome, liquid nitrogen bombs, really cool. 
got some poison bombs in here. Awesome as well. <laughs> so sweet. And I like how it travels like a fog. And clocks. I'm so sorry I couldn't show you the lantern. Antifreeze goes with the liquid nitrogen. And the blocks that turn on and off and emit poison gas. So I guess I could show you how to make the mystery pods. Clay, water bucket, spider eye, flint steel. And then to make the mystery gas block, fermented spider eyes and cobblestone. And I don't know what happened. There's the dormant mystery gas block, which is made out of dirt. I think that's for testing purposes because this mod just came out. It's getting nighttime. Here, let me. Oh, not do that. Not do that. Do that. There we go. Daytime. All right. Well, let's sling ourselves over there with a supercharge to end this up. I'm gonna give me some times. Really charge this sucker up. Woo! <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so awesome. Alright, we're gonna go up. I, I wanted to die. I thought I was gonna die, so we're gonna kill ourselves here. Sheep. Watch me. I'm about to die. Alright. Let's do it like this. <laughs> oh man. Oh wow, this is not gonna end well. I'm still up there. Oh. Gosh, I was so high. <laughs> Alright guys, great mod. Check it out. Link in the description. Until next time, this is Mbot signing out. Peace.